Welcome! In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy S22 and today I'll show you how you can put this device into safe mode. So to get started, pull down your notification panel, expand it and look for the power key right here. And once you see your boot options, you want to hold power off. This will in turn change into safe mode. Now you can see tap again to restart your phone in safe mode. Downloaded apps will be temporarily disabled to help you troubleshoot your phone. So let's confirm it. And while it's rebooting, I'm gonna just try to explain this mode a little bit. So if you are having some kind of problem with your phone, uh, as an example, you maybe have installed some kind of malicious application that is uh, causing you problems in your phone, displaying maybe some ads or just not wanting to uninstall or doing something that it really shouldn't, right? Um, and you can't use your phone because of it, as an example, now you can boot it into safe mode and in this case, that app will not be able to start just because safe mode completely turns it off. And neither you nor the app can start itself. And as you can see, once you are in safe mode, you have this little watermark right here, just so you are aware of the mode. And number two, uh, some applications just will not work like safe mode. Uh, I'm not saying what I'm saying. Uh, like widgets, as you can see, are just disabled. And let's see if there's anything else. There is, there is tips that is uh, disabled in this mode and also luckily Facebook. So if you try to open up an app that is disabled in this mode, you will get this pop-up, this, uh, what was it? Downloaded apps disabled in safe mode. And that's about it. Those apps cannot run, they cannot start themselves like Facebook would normally do, nor can you actually start them. So from here, uh, you can basically get rid of apps uh, that for instance, you couldn't for some reason and just normal mode. And once you're done with this mode and you want to go back to normal, uh, all you would need to do is again tap on this power button right here and this time around select restart which will reboot the device and take you back to the normal mode. So that being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.